Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. It's about 9 o'clock right now. It's a late start for me, but then there's that time difference. So in California, it would be 6 o'clock. But anyways, I'm going to go for that run. I ate so much yesterday. I mean, I feel fine right now, but still. Uh, don't want to let that catch up to me. So I'm going to go for a run. Then later, I'm going to go to that Easton Shopping Center. And then uh, hit up a couple of restaurants. And I got to get ready for that concert. And I got to prepare for the flight. I'm not even ready for that. I might have to check in. I don't know when, but, yeah. but anyways, first things first, cardio. So stay tuned, guys. It's about 10.30 right now. I did not expect to go out for that long. I mean, I started going and like there was no roads to run in and eventually I went in all directions. And the last one I went on led me to a bridge. It was really nice, the bridge was nice. Then I went down the bridge and under the bridge there was a path and I followed the path. It was really green, it was really nice. Really lovely, um, nice weather. But then eventually I kept following the path and it, there was like a road there. And um, you can see like bikers and stuff, other runners too. And I just kept going on it, hoping that there's another outlet out there. But, you know, it took me pretty far. So I, by the time I reached another road, it was, I was already four miles in and two miles away from my hotel. So, so then I was like, oh man, I have to like hike, uh, well, jog back another two miles when I'm already done. So that's why it's 10.30 right now. So I feel like it's a little late, but I'm on vacation. So. But let's take it easy. I mean, we'll do a, a brunch or a little thing like that, and then uh, we'll hit the East End Shopping Center, and then take it e take it from there. <sighs> I'm gonna go get ready. How's it going, guys? Uh, ready to get out? Gonna get some uh, food first. I gotta connect my uh, phone to this car. Hey, babe, I'm trying. I'm trying to get to you. Let's go jam out to these songs while I'm driving. All right, uh, let's head out. I'm gonna go to one of the four places Justine uh, recommended, which was started with a B. Brassica, Mediterranean sandwiches. Okay, this looks good. Let's try it out. I guess I would describe this place as like a, I don't know what that, Mediterranean, uh, Chipotle. I mean, it's similar, I should make it. It's really nice. It's not expensive, this is like, this is only 10 bucks. Uh, I got the falafel, it's like a, a little meatball or something. Got all the works. Let's try it out. I don't know how to start. Just gonna go right into it. They did have this uh, unlabeled bottle. I assume it's hot sauce. It smells like hot sauce. Let's try it out. Mm. So actually, the sauce is like hummus. The hummus sauce. Um, we do have a lot of pickles in here, like the pickle radishes, actual, their own pickles, the sauce is hummus, well the spread was hummus, and then the heat sauce which was uh, really smoky, uh, I'm not sure what flavor that was, but really sizing it together, it's a new flavor. Actually, almost didn't come in because it was hard to find parking and I was going to go to another place and look for another restaurant to eat at. But this is really good actually. We have like this oven. 
they make the pitas really fresh. I think the pitas like adds the best part to it. I mean, it holds it all together. It's already 12 o'clock. I'm gonna finish up here and then I'm gonna head over to the Easting uh, shopping center. See you guys in a bit. You guys don't remember. This is a telephone booth. Let's see if the, let's see if the phone actually works. Oh my god. I, just, I haven't seen one of those since uh, 1990 some. It's been a while. The children's section is so adorable. Look, look at this place. It's probably where they have story time and stuff. Oh, I'm gonna get out of here before I buy books that I'm not gonna read. I do read though, I'm not saying I don't read. I do read. But I just buy too many that I can't even get to them. Let's check out another place. Whew. I don't know why I'm in such a rush. I'm on vacation, I forgot that I, forgot I need to enjoy myself. You know? So this is what I'm gonna do for the next like 20, 30 minutes. Enjoy my coffee. Smile and say I hope you're feeling smile and say I hope you're feeling Honey, I wanna find some ice cream. This whole place, you don't have you don't have ice cream joint? Come on, get out of here. I'm gonna uh, take one more lap around. See if I, if I can't find an ice cream place. This place is freaking huge. Um, yeah, so I guess I've just been on the outside. I'm walking towards in. Uh, I'm gonna check out this central, central fountain that they have. It's just around the corner. I guess uh, that'll be the whole kit and caboodle right there. So I'm here at Jenny's uh, Planet Ice Cream. I couldn't decide between these two flavors of salt and caramel and the brown brittle. Brown butter almond brittle. So I got the two half scoops of each. They're both really tasty, so I had to get both of them. Okay. It's like a little waffle chip. I have no idea where in the boonies I am, but I have to find the United States Postal Service. Send a postcard out to you. Darling, I miss you so much. Madly, truly yours, Lair. No, I didn't say that, but yeah, I gotta send her something. Guys, I left a little bit early because I was really anxious in the hotel room. Uh, here we are now, the piece of resistance. Uh, the reason why I came to Ohio in the first place, and I can't wait to get in. Uh, I guess we're all in line. It's gonna be like another hour to let keep, uh, till the show starts. So it's barely uh, it's like seven o'clock. I think I got a really great seat. It's in a balcony, and that's my view. I'm just gonna enjoy this until I wait for the show to start. There's people down there. Those are the hardcore fans. Those seats were like five hundred dollars.
the end of it, uh, my tour is over as well. I think it was really worth it to go. It was really a really good show. Put a really good performance up. Thank you, Ohio. All right, guys, made it back home. I'm in LAX. That was a long ride. Uh, but it wasn't too bad. I think it stopped like two hours. It was a four and a half hour ride. I'm gonna head home and edit those videos. Uh, thank you for watching. Stay home, bro. And uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. I just thought it might have been a good look for the airport. I just, <laughs> I just decided to put my glasses on. It might look really suspicious right now.